Hey there, everyone. This is Alcal playing Fragile Dream. Uh, it's a dream that is fragile. Like a dream. Our dream's fra- kinda. I mean, I guess it depends on how well you're sleeping. I, I don't know. It depends on how literal you are being a dream. Well, check it out. Flashlight right in your face! Alright, so we're in a new area. Last time, we were doing shenanigans, and then a cat told us, Hey, check it out. I'm a cat. But we interpreted that as, hey, check it out, this mantle is open, and there's a drawing of a girl. I feel like I need to usher an apology. Something that kind of escaped my mind throughout this game, I've been kind of hammering on the goal of seeking out the tower. You know, Graham's told us in his little letter, hey, there's a red tower, go there. I was so focused on the location that I, I kind of forgot the reason why I told us to go there. His reason was, hey, because there might be people there. And so the reason why I said, oh, might seem very distracted to me, Wojo, is that, I mean, he has found people. The silver-haired girl is people. That would count. Uh, another one of you. All right. I need an eyeball, please. No. Keep focus there. Camera? No, keep it like that. Like, you kind of need to go far enough away that yeah, she kneels and says, Oh, check it out! You made a powerful mistake! Uh, kneeling like that in front of your enemy. What were you thinking? Well, <laughs> Sai appears. But yeah, so I think Seto was more on task than I was. I was so focused on a location, I forgot about the actual reason. Meeting new people, because he's now alone in the world. So, all of this makes a lot more sense now. I'm happy. I'm fine. There's something lurking in there. No kidding. In here? Ooh, what's this sign, though? Wait, what's this about? Please tell me... Translate! Ah, okay. About a shaft going on there. Oh boy. Oh, you're crying, Lena. Are you gonna kneel? Like, what's going on with your legs? They're like replaced by tree roots. I don't know. Okay, so I was wondering if I had to be attacked for them to go into their crouch, but it seems that that's not the case. This is just an enemy where you kind of have to wait for them to make themselves available. Well, I was too far away, but I was not punished. That's good. So, like, this is gonna be doable. Like, I will be able to cross this tunnel. It's just going to take a little bit, because you can't really take a shortcut. Yeah, see, it's because I didn't get a good critical attack. That's why it takes more hits. That is the law of the land. But if I actually did it right, then, uh, yeah, I'd be able to kill more fast good. Um, it's my mastery of English showing through. Alright, I mean, it's still, like, pretty simple. And, like, I'm already level 18, and someone dropped me a mystery item. In the shape of an angle! Can angles have a shape? Like, shapes can have angles. I don't know if the opposite can be true. You think there's gonna be more? Big ol' shaft going into the middle of nowhere. My light dances around, making everything green. Nothing to distract me but the sounds of my step and the occasional ghost mission. Yeah, I could see right there. There's something twinkling It's true. That is accurate. I don't see why I would ever use a normal flashlight ever again I <laughs> guess is the reality of it All right, it's a little fire zone. All right, you're gonna tell me hey banana bread at five o'clock excited Woo boy! Oh, that's just a pipe drawing. Okay. I was like, wait, was there a side passage? No, it's a pipe drawing. <laughs> you know, Seto gets a little bit artistic. He's a bit of a doodler. So hey, comfy. who isn't? Uh, some people aren't. Otherwise, it wouldn't be something you would say. It would just be being a person. Uh, some Galena. Yeah, my golf clubs cost me a little bit. They were expensive. 
Once golf stops being a thing that people do, golf clubs become a rarity. <laughs> they are historical artifacts of a time long lost. And I use it to hit ghosts. Message in the wall. It's watching me. Well, do you mean the lady with a giant eyeball on their back? Because, yeah, that, that's appropriate. I mean, it's accurate. Accurate and appropriate, not always equal in meaning. Check it out. Here is a rail. Oh, oh man, bird. Well, bird's singular. Alright, well, you know what? Whoa, what a powerful fight we just had. Oh, man. I can't believe I just survived that encounter. Also, I'm still hearing the. We're all dead. Oh, you're still here. And you just flew in the wall. God damn it. Alright, fine, fine. Sorry for making fun of you, Feather Duster. That's right, give me your mystery item that is gigantic. Give me that big old square of rare material. Alright, well, here we are. It's easy to call those towel hoots, when in reality they are the Kuza Pigeons. The most powerful animal of the Animal Kingdom. Kind of running out of space there. You're stuck behind a pipe, idiot! Get down here. Get down here. Hey. 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 Alright. See, this guy is gonna be fighting me earlier. Uh, well, I'm messing up. Alright, here we go. I unmessed up. Yeah, I literally do not have the room for- unless I ate my food! I guess I could. Alright, you know what, let's eat a tuna then. Sure. Whoops, yes, use this. And that's a three in a row? Kind of thing? Okay, well... Let's press the wrong button. It's always my favorite option. I need three in a row, so all I need to do... Is uh, whoop, I picked up the wrong thing. No, I don't want the icon. I want the object. No, that is not what I meant to do. Have I mentioned before my thoughts about this uh, system? Uh, whoa. Oh, I see what happened. My thoughts on this particular. Did I trash something by accident? Why is there suddenly a lot more room? Uh, right, because I had four empty and I ate a tuna. I had two empty and I ate a tuna and that gives me three. Okay, I still don't have... I need to put you... Okay, I'm gonna put you here. I'm gonna put you... He no, god damn it. Please, you're killing me. Okay, alright. Figured it out. All right, box. Pick up. Yay, we did it. I solved the puzzle, bird. You're gonna still gonna be attacking that pipe, or you're gonna turn around? Oh, now you're turning around. Now where are you, huh? Bird, please be a better enemy. It's all I'm asking, man. Like, just what are you doing? You low-quality attack bird. Come on. They just attack me or something. No? No? Yeah, no? What's going on with your face area? Yeah, well. This is not going well. Dude. But, like, if I just. Okay. Jesus, hell almighty. Level 19 somehow. Alright, well that was my most powerful foe for the entire game, and you're also kind of stuck with geometry making this very awkward, huh? Oh yeah, pipe, huh? How wide is a pipe? God damn it, camera. Camera. How wide is a pipe? How much width does a bird need? I guess this could make an argument for, hey, maybe this is why you want projectile weapons, but... I don't have the space. Oh my god, how... Just get lower down. Dive at me already. Was that really that hard? 
you bird. You just does. I don't need to think up of a better insult. Calling you bird is the insult. That's just mean. Oh, that was uncalled for. But <laughs> those were my thoughts. At the oh, riding uh, vertically. You'll die. I'm on my way. Whoa. That's a deer. But like the butt end. A deer specifically running away. Dear me. Is it maybe about time to be scratching my nose? Because that's not a... Um... Oh, maybe it is. What's that sound? It's a robot? It's a robot, and it's talking to me. What's it gonna do? Go away, robot! Ugh! Okay. Alright. I'm just gonna run past it. How about that? How about that? Yeah, that's right. You can't confirm my ID. So I'm not carrying food. And I'm kinda... Desperately... Hoping... For a fireplace. Okay, well, we're out of reach to die. Yeah, no kidding. How do you interpret that being we just encountered, Seto? <laughs> okay, well, I managed to run away at the very least. Now I am down this shaft. Maybe, okay. Oh, wait, so I had to go through a loading zone to get to the shaft itself. That's amusing. I have no idea if I'm able to fight that thing. But right now, uh, let's become a lot more risk avoidant. As we're going down, real down. <laughs> wow. Okay. We don't even get a song to go with it. It's just us and our thoughts and some dust particles around our flashlight. Sai isn't even here to give us company. She disappeared when I started going down. I don't know why. Yeah, that's just this is what she does. And you just know, if I forgot something or something and I have to go back, you're gonna have to go back up the- I mean, honestly, let's be real. Going down this ladder shaft would be... Like, just paralyzingly frightening. I would not be able to do this. For one thing, I don't trust my grip strength. And I don't trust my ability to stand on things. So, like, I'm not much of a ladder guy to start with. But, uh, no way, yeah, this is, like, chokingly high. Like, this is absolutely redonkulous. There's a amount of floor here. I don't think I can, like, jump off or anything. No, my, I, like, buttons are unresponsive beyond going down. Alright, can I have a translation on this? No? That's cool. Um, it's probably just like, it's the bean parade. There's a valve. It's a dead end. Cool. Do you mean like literally? Is that a fireplace? There's a fireplace right there, which boy howdy, am I happy to see you. Is it smart to run along the rail like that? Absolutely not. <laughs> it is... The worst possible idea. Oh, wow, look at that. Just look at my inventory. This is why I don't carry... Like, yeah. If I had a throwing weapon... Cat. The birds would have been maybe a bit less annoying. But I wouldn't be able to carry all this stuff. So, four-way split <laughs> in the sewers. Let's see what I'm carrying. Is it just gonna be money? <sighs> It's soothing watching the flames. It is, actually. I don't know if any of y'all had mm, chance to look at fire recently. Alright, large crystal. Here's outright gold. Large crystal. Ooh, seven colored bells. Sounds like a story. I looked upon those seven girls. No longer breathing. Well, that's, that's a start. I recalled the word deathbed in that bright white alley. They lay there, lifeless. 
I didn't think to explore the cause behind it. Death cannot be overturned or reversed. It stays right where it is. It doesn't go anywhere. The only reason I spilled tears was because of the wretched shape I was in. I had no memory of being loved, especially not at first glance. The day they were welcomed into their homes, they were given heirloom bells. It proved that they were loved, like family. In all my days, I'd never been given a bell. I don't think I've ever been given a bell, for what it's worth. And yet, here I was, alive, while these girls, who were supposedly loved unconditionally, were dead. It might have been poison, perhaps even disease. Maybe I, too, would be whisked off by the cold wind of death. Either way, I was alive. A part of my heart scoffed. Serves you right. Just look at the evidence. You ridiculed me, and I survived. You paid the price of cruelty with your lives. Behold, I'm alive. But no matter how much I yelled, none of them opened their eyes, and my tears didn't stop. As I picked up one bell after another off the floor, I swore to myself that I wouldn't grieve over them. I mean, it's, it's a bit late for that. <laughs> Not after I'd endured such suffering my whole life. I had the right to mock their life and death. The sound of the bells that were not mine echoed in vain through the air, like the tolling bells of a funeral. Wow, okay. That's probably pretty intense for a little Seto here. I'm... It's For this game, this is early. But I'm going to stop here. Like, we're at very clearly a... A crossroad. We are literally at a crossroad. Here we are. In a technically a five-way split. The land is split in seven... Whoa, okay, I'm just... I'm just adding numbers now. We've arrived down a path upon which splits four more paths. And so I have to ask myself, like, which one do I choose? All identical to one another, mostly. Although, they have signs, some have doors. This one has little things, but, uh, no, yeah, I stand at a crossroad. Settle's gonna have to figure that one out. Well, me, I'll figure it out for him. Sometimes we're the same people and sometimes we're not. That, that's video games.